Welcome to a brand new webisode. I'm driving home. It is Monday. Just got done having a meeting over with uh, Rosemont Copper. Man, they need to get that mine going. We need the jobs. And I'm one of those people that don't really give a rip what happens to the mountain, but hey, that's just me. But the good news is, because I think even people that support Rosemont Copper would like to see something done with the mountain. The good news is that Rosemont Copper is still going to be doing something to make the mountain look pretty in the middle of what they're doing. But it's just sad that so many people are in opposition of that which can provide uh, hundreds, well, thousands of great jobs um, and really help the economy here in Arizona, yet they uh, simply oppose it out of fear or their own little political agendas. That's unfortunate. Anyways, more importantly, other than Rosemont Copper, is the fact that today, when you're watching this, it will be primary day. You need to get out and vote for the candidate you think is going to best serve, or whatever reason. Some people will vote for those they think is the best. Some people will vote for those who they think is the most capable of beating the person that they want to see ousted from their current positions. And ultimately, all of it's okay. I've said this before, and I'll say it again, in terms of when it comes to you and your decision to vote, look, no vote is a wrong vote. You vote for who you want to vote for, who you think the best candidate is going to be. And ultimately, the decision that you make is going to be the right decision for you. And it's okay what the other guy voted because that's the right decision for them. I also want to say, too, that regardless of how much money a candidate spent in this election, okay, um, it, it, it doesn't really matter. Uh, those that want to complain that others spent too much money on their campaigns, look, if they had that much money, they would have spent it. Ultimately, it's going to be the message. Ultimately, the voter, I believe, is going to either A, vote for the person who they trust is going to be the best person to hold that seat, especially when we're talking about primaries, or for those that feel that they're the most qualified to beat the other individual. No amount of campaign signs, no amount of money really makes that big of a difference. If you are able to articulate your message better than the other guy, that's who's gonna end up winning. And I'll say it before, and I'll say, well, I've said it before, I'll say it one last time. When we get out of this primary, we need to get behind those in our party, regardless of whether or not you voted for them or not. You do whatever it is you want to do. That's just my advice. So get out and vote. What, vote early, vote often? I always thought that was weird, too, vote often. What, you can't really vote more than once. That's voter fraud. But I guess they mean vote often as in vote in every election. So I know that I will be as soon as I'm done with the show. Thanks for watching. New episode coming up on uh, Wednesday. Have fun voting. Talk to you later. Bye.